I'm somewhere in the middle Try to find myself again But life is one big riddle All the future and Scots Reserve in the Victorian high country, not far from Woods Point. G'day everybody, Steve from Mud Ducks 4 Drive Touring with another spotlight on campgrounds. Today you find us at Scott's Reserve. It's just outside the town of Woods Point. It's a fantastic area to start a run into the high country. So we'll have a look at it. And from what I can tell, realistically these roads, you can drive in two-wheel drives for sure. But I'm a big fan of bringing a four-wheel drive, so that's how I would do it. Four-wheel drives, obviously camper trailers, off-road vans and things might be okay, but uh, yeah, you're in the high country, there's probably not much else to do unless you're going four-wheel driving and having a look. And anyway, I'll give you a look at it and show you what we can. All right, so you come in on that road just there I was, and you've got a sign to welcome to Jack Scott Reserve. Tells you all about it, tells you the history of Woods Point and uh, an old photo of it, what it looked like. Anyway, we'll keep going. And there's amenities block there, which is all new. So that's really nice. Our trip leader tells me that last time we was here, a lot of this wasn't here. So I'll show you the camp section. Where I'm parked in the distance there is one of the sites and there's fire pits. Wally's over another one. There's a couple more over here, which are all very nice. It's a very nice area, and because we're in Victoria, this is free. Now, obviously, fire restrictions apply at different times of the year, so make sure you check the local information about that. So walking around this little route road thing, there is another table, another fire pit, and more room on that side of the track and you can get in up here as well and as I said for me uh, off-road van camper trailer four-wheel drives would be better there's a spot just there you can see but the roads we've driven on to get here are well maintained so you probably could come in in a two-wheel drive but like most people if you're in the high country you probably come for a little bit more interesting driving than that Woods Point is a good little town full of history plenty to have a look at if you're into history and down here where I won't go into is another couple of camp areas there where you can see the group of people 
setting up over there so I won't disturb them because yeah it's a bit rude they're just setting up it's about nearly lunchtime on a weekday here so it's fairly quiet at the moment you also would have seen near where I was parked there was a table and a shelter there's another one here so a couple of attack training killer guard dogs come and talk to me it's all good got that table there that I showed you before and then a little bit more remote I'm pretty sure you could push into here in fact we'll go for a walk in here and have a look I've never been here before guys so I'm finding out as you are oh yeah this is a cool one drive through in here probably best with tent swag you could camp a trailer it not sure what to bring anything else in here but you got a little bit more room there another fire pit so that's not a bad little semi secluded spot either that'd be a good one for a, a couple or a small family there's a mode track down there but it gets a bit rougher so i don't know what goes down there i'm not going to go wandering now that's heading the direction of woods point so maybe it's a way to walk there i don't know but uh if you do know maybe put it in the comments below so everyone else knows so there's not much more i can tell you really so i'm not sure of all the other activities that are available in this area but uh, it's a good little spot for more attack train guard dogs coming for me <laughs> it's kind of funny but um, it's a good little spot literally just out of woods point which has a little general store post office so you can get some very basic stuff there We're continuing further down today, but I thought I'd give you a look at this one anyway. So, probably another one of those my short ones, but hopefully you like it. Okay, it's not playing the game. All right, we'll do this. Doesn't want to play the game. Anyway, hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did enjoy this clip, put a like on it. Really, really helps the channel. I really appreciate it. If you're new here, consider subscribing. If you do subscribe, click the notification bell. You'll know when a new clip comes up. To the old hands, as always, thanks for taking the time out of your day to watch one of my clips. If it wasn't for you guys, I I'd have um, a lot less support, I suppose. So thanks again for uh, taking the time, guys, and being with me in support from the start. Just get out there, enjoy the bush. Cheers from Steve and Kaz at Bud Ducks 4 Drive Touring, and we'll see you on the next one. All the best. Producer Cash.